Hey guys, John here with Vapor Hunting Technologies. Today we are working with a very simple bolt. Yep, you have it, a very tiny little bolt here. You might be wondering what in the heck I'm gonna do with this. Yeah, it has a little dirt on it, no big deal. The point of the video is to show you that this process will remove zinc plating on a bolt. So you can see the yellowish tint that we have. Of course, it's a zinc plating. It's a very, very easy coating to remove in the vapor awning process. And some of you might be thinking, why would I want to remove zinc plating from a bolt? It's gonna rust. You probably will be re-zinc plating this bolt. If you're not, obviously don't put it in the vapor awning machine. But if you are going to be re-zinc plating this bolt, the vapor awning process is the way to clean this up. And one of the reasons it's the best process and one of the best ways to clean up a bolt is you're actually making the surface very smooth. By smoothing the surface, once you redo the plating, you're gonna have a very good end result. Your plating's gonna look more consistent. I mean, we get a lot of questions, and that's why I wanted to really show you this, but it will remove zinc plating very easily, and some people, again, do or do not want to do such as that. We're gonna show you how fast it is, so stay tuned. Okay guys, back after blasting, literally that was seconds. You can see how fast it was able to remove the coating. This bolt is ready for replating. If you're going to do such a thing as that, again, it puts a very consistent, very smooth finish on the bolt. You're not actually removing or damaging the threads here, which is another key important fact and feature. We will remove the zinc plating very quickly in the process, literally 10 seconds. This is what you're left with. So you're ready to replate the bolt. Um, I hope you guys like what you saw today. And if you have questions about applications or other issues that you might come up with in a manufacturing process and you want us to try to help, give us a call or shoot us an email. And if you like what you saw today, please follow the Instagram page and like our Facebook page and subscribe to our channel. So thanks for watching.